All right, this is going to be a bit of a different video on this channel, an experiment or a simulation, whatever you want to call it. But Norwich City, after being promoted to the Premier League, have pulled off the two most insane signings pretty much of all time. Messi and Cristiano Ronaldo have both agreed to sign for Norwich City on a free contract. I don't think that's something you will ever hear again in your lifetime. Ronaldo and Messi are playing for Norwich City. So the basis for this experiment or simulation is can Messi and Ronaldo save Norwich City from relegation this season? Those are the only two signings that Norwich are going to make this season. Messi and Ronaldo, no signings in January. We are just going to see if Ronaldo and Messi can save them from the relegation that they have suffered this season in real life. Take a look at that. Messi and CR7 in the Norwich City kits. That just doesn't look right. It just does not look right. But can Messi and Ronaldo improve Norwich City enough to save them from relegation? Let's take a quick look at the starting 11 I've put together. So up top, it's Ronaldo, Puki, and Messi. Midfield is Duda, Tribal, and Buendia. Back four, Lewis, Zimmerman, Godfrey, and Aarons. We're going for rating mostly, trying to put together the best starting 11 that Norwich can. I think this is it. Ronaldo and Messi playing in their most natural positions, I guess. We have disabled the first transfer window, so no other teams are going to be bringing in new players. So at least till January, it's going to be the default squads. And we're going to see what Messi and Ronaldo can do for Norwich. All right, we are at the first game of the season. It is Liverpool away. And unfortunately, Ronaldo has gone down one in his overall already. That is not a good sign. Ronaldo is 34. Messi is 32. So they probably will go down this season. But they are still the best players in the world. All right, first game against Liverpool. Let's see what we can do. Messi and Ronaldo's Premier League debut for Norwich. And we go down 1-0 in four minutes. Sadio Mane scores for Liverpool. That is not a good start. Thiago scores for Liverpool. Oh yeah, these squads are altered. So like Liverpool has Thiago, Chelsea has Timo Werner. But Salah scores and Fabinho scores. Van Dijk gets injured. Duda scores one for us. And Origi scores one. So that is 5-1. Messi and Ronaldo did not do anything for us. 5-1 to start off the season. That is not a good start. Not a good start at all. So Messi got a 63 out of 100 for that game and Ronaldo got a 73 out of 100. Ronaldo did get an assist, so he had a goal contribution, but that was not a good way to start the season. All right, we are going to simulate to just before the January transfer window and we'll see where Norwich is. All right, so we are at the end of December and Norwich City are in 15th place after 20 games. So that is better than real life. They are six points clear of the relegation zone. So it is an improvement, but let's look at Messi and Ronaldo's stats to see what kind of impact they're having. All right, so Ronaldo has six goals and three assists in 22 games, and Messi has three goals and five assists in 22 games. So that is not really good. I mean, Messi five assists isn't bad, but nine goals between the both of them, that is not as much as I expected. They have decent average match ratings, but definitely lacking in the goals department. Sterling has 19 goals in 20 games. What a season for him. So we're not even on the top 20, not even top 25 in the league, Ronaldo or Messi. In assists, I'm pretty sure they're not either. Um, nope. So not in the top 25 in goals or assists, but Tim Krul is fourth in clean sheets. So he's definitely doing his job. I expected better from them. I really did. At least we are not bottom of the league. So we were knocked out in the Carabao Cup by Man City 5-4 on penalties. So no Carabao Cup for Norwich. We just have the Premier League and the FA Cup now this season. We are not going to make any signings in January. We're going to see if Ronaldo and Messi can keep Norwich in the Premier League this season. So we are going to simulate ahead a little bit. All right, so January is over and Norwich have gone up one spot. They're in 14th. So now they are six points clear of the relegation zone. Like I said before, better than real life. We take a quick look at the top. Man City's in first with United three points behind them and Liverpool in third. And then Chelsea, Spurs, and Arsenal in eighth. Very much like real life. Actually better than real life for Arsenal. So how about that? Let's see what transfers have been made in January. Oh, not many. Not many big names. Lacazette has gone to Liverpool. Barnes to Barcelona. Zaha to Dortmund. I can see that happening in real life, actually. Bartra to Chelsea. Not much in terms of huge, huge names. All right, so we've made it to the round of 16 of the FA Cup and we have Everton next. Unfortunately, Pookie is injured, so Dermich is going to have to come in for him. And I have a feeling we might get eliminated in this game. I have a slight suspicion. 
Let's see what we can do in this round of 16 versus Everton. Come on, Messi Ronaldo. This is the time to shine. These are big games. That is not good. Richarlison scores for Everton. And Buendia gets a red card. But Messi scores one back. Is 1-1. We have hope in this game. Ronaldo scores our second 2-1 against Everton. Can we make it to the quarterfinals? 10 minutes left. And they equalize. We're going to extra time. Messi scores. And they score again. It's 3-3. What a game this is, 110 minutes, five minutes left. It's gonna go to penalties and we win on penalties. What a game that was. Messi and Ronaldo basically getting us to the quarterfinals of the FA Cup. What a simulation that was. In terms of Premier League, we are back into 15th, but we're, we're only four points clear of the relegation zone now, actually. So we have dipped in form, it seems. That is not good not good four points is not really safe all right so we are in the quarterfinals of the fa cup and our next tie is against west ham wickham are in the quarterfinals and it seems like spurs and united maybe leicester are only big teams left in this competition can we possibly find success in the fa cup if we can in the premier league away versus west ham pookie is back see what messi and ronaldo can do penaldo scores we are one nil up in the sixth minute that is a good start for us 70 minutes played, Ronaldo scores, but Fornals scores, it's 2-1, don't do this, don't do this, and we win, and we advance to the semifinals, Ronaldo scoring 2 against West Ham. Alright, so it is April 1st, there has been 30 Premier League games played this season so far, and Norwich are sitting in 16th, 3 points clear of the drop zone, what has happened, how are we doing so good in the FA Cup, but we are this close to the relegation zone in the Premier League, how is this possible? That is not good, that is not good at all. In the FA Cup, we're in the semis, and we are facing Manchester United, that's going to be a tough one. So let's sim these next 3 Premier League games and see where we stand. All right, so we lost this Arsenal game 2-0. We drew with Brighton and we won against Watford 2-1. That was a really big win. Ronaldo and Messi both scored in that game. So we're back to 15th place. We are five points clear of the relegation zone. That is better than what we were before. Five games in the Premier League left to go. Things might get interesting. All right, we won this game against Southampton. Penaldo scoring once again with a penalty. And that grabbed all three points for us. Let's see where we stand on the table after this game. So a very big three points sees us eight points clear of the relegation zone. That is looking a lot better. Ronaldo and Messi might have just sealed our, our stay in the Premier League this season. But up next, we have the semifinals against Man United in the FA Cup. All right, so we are actually going to play this FA Cup against Manchester United. Get a little bit of gameplay in this episode. Plus, I'm very curious to use Ronaldo and Messi. We are playing this on Ultimate. The team isn't looking too great in terms of fitness, but eh, we'll be fine. All right, let's see what the boys can do. First time using Messi and Ronaldo in a played game in this little experiment slash rebuild slash whatever you want to call it. Buki into Ronaldo. Ronaldo turns against his former team and he puts it wide. So close to putting us up 1-0. Messi outside the box and that's a goal from Lionel Messi first goal in the FA Cup semi-final for Norwich what a goal by Messi this curling shot on his left foot that is beautiful Puki over the top to Ronaldo he's in Ronaldo is in is he gonna get caught and Ronaldo wins a penalty right before halftime there's only one person who's taking this Cristiano Pinaldo. Can he score it? He does against his former team. And that is 2-0 for Norwich City against Manchester United. Ronaldo and Messi both bagging goals. We're going into halftime up 2-0. Puki. Ronaldo's in. Can this seal the game for us? Ronaldo. Near post. On his left foot. That's actually far post. And Ronaldo celebrates this time that is 3-0 and Norwich is heading to the FA Cup final Norwich City confirmed heading to the FA Cup final after beating Manchester United 3-0 two goals from Ronaldo one goal from Messi what a performance to beat Manchester United so it is Norwich versus Spurs in the FA Cup final so final month of the season we are sitting in 15th still eight points clear of the relegation zone it looks like we are going to stay in the Premier League, but anything can happen. All right, so we lost our first two games of this month. Chelsea 4-0 and Burnley 2-0 at home. 
final two games of the season, West Ham and then Manchester City. But even though we lost our two games, I think we are confirmed staying in the Premier League. We are six points clear of Crystal Palace and we have a game at hand. So I'm pretty sure we are staying in the Premier League this season. So it looks like Messi and Ronaldo have saved Norwich from relegation. And this 1-0 win pretty much confirms it. Messi with the goal. Norwich are staying in the Premier League. Final game of the season, Man City. Probably going to be a commanding loss. And it's a 3-0 loss. But the job has been completed. We finish in 15th, pretty much where we were this whole entire season. Seven points clear of the relegation zone. So Messi and Ronaldo have in fact saved Norwich from relegation. And Man City won the title on 105 points. So stats for this season, Ronaldo with 15 goals and six assists, and then Messi with 10 goals and seven assists. That is not as many goals as I expected from them, but you can pretty much tell from the stats here that they are the reason that Norwich have stayed up this season. Final stats from around the league, Sterling 28 goals in 38 games, Mane with 17 assists, and Ederson with 19 clean sheets. So still, Ronaldo and Messi are out of the top 25. Pretty sure in both categories, yep. That might be due to the players around them, but in the FA Cup, they have been playing very well, and that's why we're in the final. So before we end this video, we are gonna play the FA Cup final against Spurs. Messi and Ronaldo have saved Norwich from relegation, but now, can they win Norwich the FA Cup? So on to the FA Cup final. Corner crossed in. Don't know what happened there. We're tonging and we survive. Sun on the wing into Harry Kane and Spurs take a 1-0 lead. 20 minutes played. Spurs have gotten their first goal of the game. All right, can we respond? Messi on this wing. Past one and he's taken out and that's going to be a penalty. Directly after Spurs score, they give up a penalty. There is no question on who is taking this. Cristiano Penaldo. And that is a perfect penalty. This game is tied in the 24th minute. It is 1-1. Duda out to Messi. Down the wing. One, our first penalty. Gets past one. Gets past him again. Gonna have a shot. And that is over the bar. All right, so we are going into halftime tied at 1-1. Ronaldo could be in here. I see Messi on the other half of the field. It's going to come into Thibaut Pukki. Somehow back to Ronaldo. Somehow back to Ronaldo. Fires it in and Lloris saves it. Ronaldo could be in a spot here. Ronaldo, almost 80 minutes played and Lloris saves that. Kind of messed up that opportunity. Ball into Harry Kane. Not like this. Not like this. Deli Alley scores and it's 2-1 for Tottenham in the 83rd minute. We have eight minutes to try and get an equalizer in this game. Oh, 90 minutes played. Spurs are just not giving us the ball. We win it there into Messi. We just need to get it forward. We have a minute left. Ronaldo just has to go forward and we can't even push the ball to the head of the field and Tottenham win the FA Cup. We lose 2-1. Oh, we got so close to winning a trophy in this video, but Norwich are staying in the Premier League for next season. And that was the goal of this video. And Messi and Ronaldo have done that. On top of that, almost winning Norwich a trophy. So close, but if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like. Leave a comment on other simulation slash experiment ideas you guys have, and I might just do them. But that is going to be the end of this video. The Southampton Crew Mode will be back in my next video, and I hope you all have a great day.